How's it going everybody? Welcome back to the vlog. Do you know what you're having? Is usually the first question I get. And then, do you know what you're gonna name her? Is usually the second question that comes up right away. If they ask, I tell them right away. I tell them her name is Olga. No, it's not. I didn't want a European name. I don't want like some kind of biblical name. I didn't want Adam, Aaron, and Ezekiel was out of the question. <laughs> Definitely not religious. So that's all those names are out. Yeah, I really do like, I do like picking names. I like like thinking of names, finding names, find meaning between names, <laughs> branding your child. <laughs> it's funny because when I was a kid, I used to love these like British surnames as first names. So like Hayden and Barker. Then I realized kids would tease them or even bark at them. Years later, then I got really into like state names and city names. So like Texas, Mississippi, Georgia. I'm just kidding. I none of those names, but you know what I mean? I like city names like Brooklyn, like Charlotte, like Florence. Those are names again I would never use. Those names got so freaking popular. Well, not Texas. Something that isn't gonna be hard to spell, like my last name. D is in David. I don't want her to come to me later on and be like, why the hell is this my name? And I have like absolutely no reason. I was just like, I don't know. Uh, your mom and I were like, we both swiped right on the name. I think they just came out with Canada's top 10 or whatever. From one of these names, we're gonna pick our baby. <laughs> top baby name, 2020 Canada. All right, top five names. Number five, how do we do this? Just say it, Oliver? <laughs> yep. How about I just read all five of them right now? It's Oliver, number five, Lucas, number four, Noah, number three, number two is Jackson, and number one is Liam. Not exciting. Not bad. <laughs> we go back to like our generation where everybody was Matt, Mike, Francesca. What? <laughs> Mary Antoinette. <laughs> oh, you didn't have a lot of Ashley's and Jennifer's and Jessica's? No, we had all the time. I remember that in like Toronto when I was in like grade eight. Although there was still a lot of Jennifer's. No, it was Montreal. Montreal had like a lot of Donatello, Raphael. I feel like there was always a lot of Mike's, Matthew's, obviously. Mm -hmm. A lot of Matt. No one ever went by Matthew. It's weird. <laughs> Weirdos. Anyways, yeah, so those are the names <laughs> for boys. What are the girl ones? Top five Zoe, Sophia, <laughs> Mia, Emma, and Olivia. Apparently, Olivia was number one every province across Canada. Yeah, that name like blew up like why? Like five or ten years ago or something like that, or, or at least five years ago. <laughs> From all your research, why Olivia? <laughs> what was um, your name was the year you were born? Ooh, that's a good question. There must be a number one, <laughs> Jennifer. Boy, Michael. What about your year? My name probably isn't in. Like even the top 100. <laughs> no, Thanks, <would> you... guys. <laughs> Jessica's number one. Ashley, Amanda, Sarah, and then for boys, oh, yeah. Michael, Christopher, Matthew, Joshua. Still number three here. You like rarely meet a Don. No, that is good. I always liked being the only one. Oh look, our baby name is right there. No, it's not. <laughs> you lose. Congratulations, you lost. You lost the baby name game. No, I didn't. I remember I really liked the name Sloan and you wanted no part of it. Yeah, because I didn't like the band. <laughs> <laughs> well, how did you not like that band? Sloan? 